no way. Here, get that. Oh, That's pretty clean. Looks weird without it. It's like badge delete. Those are usually expensive too. It's clean as hell now. Just z 8 both cars, did the wheels, did the exhaust, did the windows. Well, it sounds like 4 a.m. in my garage, doesn't it? This is what we do on Thanksgiving. Still have the cleaning supplies in there. 23,000 miles now. Really getting up there. <sighs> Smooth and clean as can be. Both of them. Both look really good. I think the M5 has like 36,000 miles or something like that on it. Just He just cleaned the uh, <clears throat> windshield in and out. I don't think it'll show me miles because I don't have a key. Or is it like mine? Yep, it does. 37,017. And it's a freaking 06. Nuts. Nuts. This car spent a lot of time in Germany, though, before it came over here. I don't think it came over here until like 08 or something. But we've got two nice clean cars now. Raz, Raz, it's the song, dude. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm standing over here trying to load this site. This guy wants to send me something to review for E39 source, but his site doesn't load. So I have these two pending things in my inbox, which are giving me ulcers. So I need to, to get rid of that before they really bother me. But that makes me miss Saturday, so I'll have to get back soon. Well, they were kind of right today. It's a little cloudy out there. <laughs> I'll take it. Finally done with the construction here. That fence is gone. The regular CTS was hideous, let alone that's a 55. 55. It's okay, 55. It's a 528. Missing an eye badge on it. Is that an M5? No, 540. Missing a gas cap door. Yeah. It's an 8 series for sale. I don't know if that was an 840 or an 850, but we'll have to check Craigslist and make a purchase. There's the next one. We'll probably see some cool things here. M5 down there. Red F10 or orange F10. I've actually never seen one of those. Oh, the Christmas ribbons are out. Yeah. I saw those last December. Tenemera. Too bad it's not a manual. You can just flip the thing around, slide it over, and put it in there. Data Zoo. See if our spot's still there. Keep going. The Impala. Ugh. Impala drivers. They're the worst, Jerry. The worst. We found the M5. It's um, yeah, the wheels. Yeah, I don't know if they're painted black or they've just never been cleaned. That, that's that. They call it their something orange. It's not Valencia orange. Yeah, I don't, I'm not a big fan of the color. Didn't film the DB9, but I'll get the Maserati. GT. Very nice.
LP560-2. And there's the implant. That's on the park down there. Yeah. It's an M6. That's a Bentley. Also with a handicap. So I guess the, the handicap people are driving driving Giardos and Bentleys now. Wow. Too bad they're wasting that real estate. Andrew, I found your car. This is a man it is a manual with the ZHP shifter in it. 328. Or is it a three? 323. You have your uh credit card.
Only in California, right? I mean, where else in the United States? Maybe Mexico, that's south. That's obviously not in the United States, but where else in this country does this happen? We saw one car going north in the southbound lanes, the 15. I imagine that is quite illegal. didn't make it over the berm so we had to come down into oncoming traffic of the 15 and that guy's going on oh my gosh they're getting on the 15 wow take a hint bud oh my god <laughs> there's what we couldn't make it over so we had to go the long way around the 540 wouldn't make it over that either Colt although I think I could get the M5 over that at an angle maybe They opened the uh, 15 South, so I would imagine they've cleared the blockage, and uh, hopefully that's fixed. But it'll take hours for that to clear, so we're taking an alternative route. Another S7. Got the spoiler up on that one. Okay, sweet addition, we're home now. We uh, went out, tried to go to Walmart for Black Friday. Wow, that was a mistake. 800 people online, we got in the car and left. We just needed a couple hardware things. Ended up getting most of them at Walgreens. So this is the bar out here, and it now has under lighting. One in the center of that stone wall, one in the center of this stone wall, and another one over here. Looks really nice. This will be usable space. Now we're thinking we're gonna get some Christmas lights up here for the umbrella so you can actually see the table. or something where you can see it or these lights on the trellis aren't even on right now. But as far as lighting that part up, that looks really good. So we just watched some gringo movie. It's after 11 now. And uh, I'm gonna get to bed because tomorrow we're getting up early and we'll get some travel plans. Um, it'll be exciting. It'll be exciting. It'll be a fun day tomorrow. So tune in for that. We're still working on stuff around the house since all the stores were closed today. We didn't get as much done as we wanted. This is a phone jack that used to live here. We're going to try to get rid of that and put a dummy plate on it or something. Uh, a, little, a little hardware stuff like that. Those lights outside we did. We need spackling to, to uh, fill in some holes for the previous owners. Had some pictures hung or something until we get stuff here. But uh, I'm going to do the emails and do the normal stuff and get to bed. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Probably from the car. Alright. Good night.